Hey, this is Greg Shields, and you've found the final of my courses in this learning path on VMware Horizon 7. This time on the integration of vRealize Operations Manager with VMware Horizon. I am author evangelist and a full-time author here at Pluralsight, and I've been working with VMware solutions since the days that those virtual machines were nearly always just servers. You may have noticed that this course is by far the shortest in our eight-course learning path on VMware Horizon. That is by no means to presume that vRealize Operations Manager is the least important. Rather, monitoring a complex environment with dozens of moving parts is arguably your most important task once Horizon's components are assembled and VMs get provisioned to users. That task is best left to another solution in vRealize Operations Manager, or vROPS, which we assume here to be already monitoring your hypervisors and vCenter servers. In this course, you'll explore the discrete tasks in integrating that already existing vRealize operations infrastructure into the Horizon View components we've built so far. You'll install the necessary broker agent onto your connection server, create a vRealize operations for Horizon adapter, and you'll leave with a quick and dirty overview of the new dashboards and reports vROPS now offers to dig into your VDI environment's deepest behaviors. If you've just been tasked with installing and configuring a Horizon 7 environment in your organization, this course is your final stop in brushing up on those skills for success. And then from here, you'll be ready to continue on the learning path as you apply the skills you've learned here in building your own production-ready VMware Horizon infrastructure. Let's get started. <laughs>